Hello everyone, uh, this is Neil. Welcome to my channel. I am going to talk about you know, the A2.1 Q tunneling, which is also known as Q and Q. Uh, this is my possibly the third uh, IT related video. Uh, if you do like uh, or you know, like if you got any comments uh, about the video, please do leave in the comment section so that you know I can. Uh, you know they um, improve the videos or anything uh, in future so so the so whole point of this q and q uh, video is just to give you uh, the, the visual interpretation how it uh, actually looks like um, so this sort of uh, you know the q and q tunneling is mostly popular in the metro ethernet uh, scenario i.e service provider uh, lay to you know, the VPN for the customers, you know. So, um, by using you know the uh, different uh, villain tag for each customer, uh, we can separate the traffic uh, from different customer and also transparently transfer it throughout the service provider networks. So, as you can see in the diagram, I have. Um, root to one and root to two as customer device uh, which are connected to the service provider switches um, so we have three switches which is one uh, two and three uh, service provider will use the second villain tag uh, 33 whereas the customer uh, is going to use the villain tag 22 uh, so in my example um, you know like let's see how you know this uh, q and q actually works so let's go to the video so as you can see uh, the tag vlan from router one is uh, uh, in the, um, moving towards the switch one as soon as it reaches to the service provider switch one what switch one will do is will add the additional uh, second uh, vlan tag which is 33 uh, so uh, after that switch one uh, they moves uh, the uh, the frame towards the switch two switch two will move frames towards the switch three so what happens in switch three is switch three will uh, for the frames towards the router two uh, before it does that it's gonna uh, pop or remove the vlan tag 33 uh, as you can see in the green uh, box uh, that's going to be removed and the original tag uh, vlan 22 from router 1 will be uh, forwarded to the uh, in the router 2 uh, so this is how actually the in the q and q works uh, if you want to see um, the uh, 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 you know the, the how the frame Ethernet frame looks like. You know, the, as you can see, the uh, original Ethernet, Ethernet frames. Um, there's no tag. You know, so when customers, you know, the uh, frame, uh, the tag frame uh, with 22 comes from the root one, the as this tag. Uh, so as soon as it reaches its service provider network, and the service provider will add the second tag, which is, is, in, the, is in the green box. Um, this is how it looks like between switch one, switch two, and switch three. So, so this this uh, in the this tag frame. Uh, that's how it looks before it uh, uh, was you know, the, uh, forwarded towards the service provider switch one and after it leaves the uh, uh, switch three you know uh, so yeah towards the route route two so i hope you know this video uh, helps you to understand the q and q in really simple terms uh, if you do like, uh, you know, please share and subscribe for more videos. Or and if there's any um, uh, comments, uh, please do leave the uh, in the comment section below, and it will really help me to uh, you know to encourage. Or yeah, if I need to improve in further videos, uh, please do let me know. If you want any sort of uh, videos. I will try my best to come up with uh, you know this visual interpretation and try to explain. Uh, thank you. Don't stay. Bye. Have a good day.